Hey my friends, my friends, it's Gene. Hey, what's up? Hey, trying to live video again on the Facebook. Look, it's daytime. I'm out here. Got the beautiful lake behind me. There it is. And I just thought, I just wanted to jump on and say, hey, see how you're doing here in the middle of the afternoon. Maybe you're getting up and getting out and doing some things. You know, let me know what you might be doing. But something I wanted to talk about real quick because it's just something on my mind because I'm listening to some music and uh, I was listening to the band Blind Melon. And I just listened to a podcast from Rolling Stone magazine about uh, Dolores O'Rourke from the Cranberries. And they're talking about uh, the Cranberries and Nirvana and all these other bands that just seemed to have lost their singers, <laughs> you know, to drugs, depression, suicide, that type of thing. And it just really got me thinking. I'm listening to Blind Melon. He died of heroin overdose. You know, Shannon Hoon did. And this and that. And I'm like, all my favorite bands from especially the 90s you know, have no lead singers left. You know, for the most part, except for, thank God, Eddie Vedder's, they must be wrapped him in bubble wrap or something to keep him alive and well with Pearl Jam, but I don't know. You know, and I'm like playing some of this music for my son, and I have to tell him, I'm like, oh, this is another, another band with the singer that died, you know, from a drug overdose or suicide or something like that. And it's just really a bummer that I have to do that. And I just wanted to say, and it just made me think that there's a lot of people struggling. I'm struggling. You're struggling. A lot of people are struggling. I'd say probably most of us are struggling in some way or another. Nobody has a perfect life. There's no way you're going to find anybody with a perfect life. Even if they portray it on social media or something like that, nobody has a perfect life. You can find some flaws in everybody. But those people out there, that especially us artist folk, you know, that might be struggling, might need a little help from their friends, from you, the friends. You know, I might need a little help. I don't know, I'm just saying. But, you know, we put it out there. We put our heart and souls out there in our art, our music, our passions, what we do. Me doing these videos, people playing gigs all the time, you know, people taking pictures, painting something, drawing something. You know, us art is folk. You know, a lot of us are just struggling. We're emotionally deep. We're just, you know. So, hey, if you know people like that and you see that they're struggling, just put it out there ask them hey you know just say hi that type of thing I know I've talked about this probably a dozen times before in these videos that I've done it's 230 some videos that I've done I probably talked about it once or twice but you got people out there that you know might need a little help just say hi to them reach out you know send a little note here on Facebook say hey how you doing man how you doing oh my gosh some kind of bird some kind of creature coming after me <laughs> so if I disappear here I apologize because there seems to be some kind of creature out here. But hey, I gotta run, but I want you to think about it today. I'm tired of losing people, and I know these, the artists and stuff, you know, the musicians, whatever, from the 90s that I love and adore, that have died are fictitious characters in my world, or whatever, no, they're real, really. But we got people around, especially here in Wilmington, people that are struggling, you know, there's a little addiction with the, the, the smack and stuff, and this and that, and the different drugs, and there's been drug busts with the fentanyl and all that, you know? There's people addicted to this stuff, truly. And there's it's not just the drug dealers dealing it out. It's, you know, these pharmaceutical people. But that's a whole other story. But, hey, you got friends that are struggling with depression, drugs, alcohol, anything like that. Help them out. Send them my way. I'll be glad to talk to anybody, believe me, because it helps me when I can help other people. It helps me. It, it just fills my spirit when I can help other people. And I hope and pray that, you know, I can lift somebody up and get them out of their funk or whatever. And, you know. And see what we can do. Maybe we can help one person today. Two, three, four, five. Like I say, every day. You know, can we do that? Hey, if you dig this, if you want to share it, share it. There's a share button here. Share it with your friends. Whatever you got to do. I'm not going to tell you what to do. Just do what you got to do. Let's see if we can help some people today. Because I'm tired of losing people that I love and adore. Okay? Hey, peace and chicken grease. I'll talk to you later. Bye.